I uh, hope everyone is doing well. My name is Arun from usitrecruit.com. I hope you remember the last video which I was talking about an X-ray search tool which you can automatically search resumes on Google without uh, manually writing the X-ray search. But in today's video, we are going to cover about what is an X-ray search, what are the operators included in this X-ray search and what we gonna do with that x-ray search and what is the use of x-ray search rather than sourcing the resumes directly in the portals or in the LinkedIn and what are the uh, effects which we gonna face by using this x-ray search so uh, before we get started a uh, quick request is that if you haven't subscribed to this channel please do subscribe and hit on that bell icon which is at the below the definition of what is an x-ray search frankly speaking but there is no definition for an x-ray search but let's put it in this way x-ray search is a few of commands which we use to source uh, the information around the web using the search engines like Google or Yahoo or Bing these are very special commands which we give to the internet to source a particular type of information and what are the uses of this x-ray search we will get the hidden uh, talent which we doesn't able to source the resumes using our search engines or our ads and what is the disadvantage see as we see that there are lots many information or there are so much of data in the web so while we are searching for resumes or any other information particular information like phone numbers or email address of the candidates we used to get lost of all this information or because of this data so we need to be very particular about the terms or the commands which we give to the search engine in order to get the particular results from it hope uh, you understand the definition of this x-ray search so let's go further little further and discuss about the operators which we use to search in the internet for the required information there are five uh, x-ray search operators which are in title in url and file type not and site these are the very important operators which we use in this x-ray search to uh, go dive deep into the web so that we can able to find the hidden talent over all the platforms in the internet like LinkedIn, GitHub, Stack Overflow or any kind of uh, uh, social networking sites like Facebook, Twitter and anything. And the first and the foremost operator is a site which is a very popular operator in x-ray search. Uh, as the name itself says that as you can see here the site colon which is uh, only restricted to a particular website see when you search on a google like site colon and the name of the site like usitrecruit.com or cnn.com or bbc.com you will see the results only from those particular website as you can see here the url name will be from the particular websites only so do remember these applications because we are going to uh, discuss the same concepts in the upcoming videos and one more thing to remember is that there is no space between the site and the colon and the second uh, the operator is in title as the name itself says that the in title when you search for this kind of search in the google like in title colon and the given keyword or a given phrase without any spaces between the colon and the given word you will get the results saying that suppose if you are searching for a resume for a Hadoop developer so we can use in title colon Hadoop developer you will get the resumes or you will get the websites which is having the Hadoop developer as a title in their a website title name so we will discuss how we can include or how we can mix this the operators like site and in title in the 
uh, upcoming videos